Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Now we are going to solve one Python program. So write a function called is sorted. Function name is is sorted. That is given a list and returns true if the list is sorted and false otherwise. So what is the function name? Is sorted. It takes list as a input and it returns a value either true or false so based on sorted now we can see the example so for example i entered a list 12 13 35 now so this is in the sorted order so it returns true if i enter 35 13 12 it is not sorted so it returns false now we see the program. So L equals to so list of input of enter list items. So this message is displayed on monitor. Here I am going to give the numbers 12, 13, 35. So those are stored as a list. And the list name is L. L equals 12, 13, 35. Now I call the function is sorted and Arguments are L. That means so 12, 13, 35 is assigned to L here. Now, I store this L in X. That means X is also 12, 13, 35. Here, we are using square brackets column. So, Y means, for example, A equals to 5, B equals to A. Then, so what is the a equals to 5 means? The 5 have some identity number. So, the, for example, the identity number of 5 is 10001856. And a is indicating to 10001856. If I am creating a variable b equals to a, that means for the b, the PVM, so Python virtual machine cannot allow a separate memory location. So already 5 is in the memory location. So the same identity is given to B else. That means both A and B have same ID. If you, so how we know the ID of the variable means by using ID of A. If you print ID of A, then both A and B have the same identity of object okay similarly x equals to l that means x have some object like this without this if i assign x equals to l then so l is also so x is also 12 13 35 but both the have same id object identity so that means if i change the l automatically x also change so, so that's why we don't want that. So I can use square brackets column. That means now the contents is the same, but the IDs are different. This have some ID 1001352. So this have another ID 1450. So both have different IDs. So because of square column. So next x dot sort. So this is the sort. 12, 13, 20. 12, 13, 35. Now we can check that. L equals to equals to X or not? Yes, it is equals to equals to yes. So in this case, you are going to print 2. We take another case. 35, 13, 12. So 35, 13, 12. So this is assigned to X here. 35, 13, 12. In this case, if you are not writing this, so both the addresses are, both the object IDs are same. X dot sort mean automatically that reference L. So that's why in this case, so that's why we are using this square column. So now X dot sort. What is the X dot sort? 12, 13, 35. Now we can check 12, 13, 35 equals to equals to 35, 13, 12. No. So in this case, it returns false. Now we see the execution of the program.
entered list item for example i entered 12 34 56 78 90 all are in sorted order so it returns true now I entered 12 34 56 23 89 now the 23 is in not sorted order now we can see that it returns false 